Now, a scary scene overnight in Mount Hope when a car plowed into a family's home, barely missing two young children asleep in a room. ABC 10 News reporter Marie now takes us through the family's moments of panic after that crash. A mother holds on to her son as she's comforted by family members after living through a terrifying situation. Late Wednesday evening, a driver lost control of this white car on Home Avenue, driving through the guardrail and crashing into the Ocompass's home. Inside, asleep in a bed, two young children, ages three and six. Their dad, Carlos, describes what he saw. Ran to the kids, walk into the room with a whole car in our bedroom. Kids are not on the bed, digging through the stuff. Me and my wife looking for the kids. They're not responding. Eventually, they found their two children under the rubble and debris. For moments in my head, I was like, is this it? It's, you know, it's hard to think it, but when you're just looking at there, you can't hear them, you can't see them. But this isn't the first time something like this has happened in this specific neighborhood. In 2016, our breaking news tracker was there as another car made it past the guardrail, but that time landed just inches away from another house. This morning, city crews were back again, replacing the guardrail as the family begins the process of cleaning up what's left of their home. As for the driver who crashed into this home, that person was injured and taken to the hospital. Police say at this point, the cause of the crash is still under investigation. Reporting from Mount Hope, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News.